10 Signs of an Emotionally Abusive Relationship Are you in a relationship where something feels off, but you can't quite pinpoint what's wrong? Emotional abuse can be subtle, pervasive, and deeply damaging. Unlike physical abuse, emotional abuse leaves no visible scars, yet it can erode your confidence, happiness, and mental health over time. Emotionally abusive individuals often deny their behavior, leaving their partners confused and questioning reality. If any of the following signs resonate with you, it may be time to reassess your relationship and prioritize your emotional well-being. 1. You feel unsafe expressing concerns. In a healthy relationship, both partners should feel safe discussing their thoughts and concerns. But if you hesitate to bring up issues because you fear your partner's reaction, this is a warning sign. When you do voice your concerns, an emotionally abusive partner might respond with anger or aggression, stonewall you by refusing to engage in the conversation, use retribution, such as punishing you emotionally or financially for speaking up. This creates an environment where you suppress your feelings leading to emotional isolation. Over time, you might stop voicing concerns altogether, fearing the consequences. 2. Conversations lead to defensiveness and anger. Have you noticed that every disagreement turns into an argument or a blame game? An emotionally abusive partner often reacts defensively, making it impossible to resolve issues. Instead of addressing the problem, they may shift the blame onto you, deny or minimize their behavior, rationalize their actions or play the victim. For example, if you express hurt over a sarcastic comment, they might accuse you of being too sensitive. This tactic not only invalidates your feelings, but also shifts the focus away from their behavior. 3. Your opinions and feelings are dismissed. In an emotionally abusive relationship, your voice often feels silenced. Your partner may interrupt you during conversations, roll their eyes or dismiss your ideas as unimportant, make decisions without consulting you. This consistent lack of respect can make you feel insignificant. Over time, you may start doubting your opinions and suppressing your emotions to avoid confrontation. 4. You feel invisible and worthless. One of the most heartbreaking effects of emotional abuse is the feeling of invisibility. You might feel like you're physically present but emotionally absent in your partner's life. They may rarely ask about your day or your thoughts, dismiss your achievements or belittle your efforts, show no interest in your personal growth or happiness. This lack of acknowledgement can leave you questioning your worth, eroding your self-esteem. 5. Disagreement leads to rage. Healthy relationships allow for respectful disagreements. However, an emotionally abusive partner often reacts to any challenge with intense anger or rage. They may yell or shout to intimidate you, use threats to silence you, withdraw affection or support as a form of punishment. For example, if you disagree with their opinion on a family issue, they might accuse you of being disloyal or ungrateful. This hypersensitivity to criticism makes it difficult to express yourself honestly. 6. They show little interest in your likes and dislikes. In a loving relationship, both partners take an interest in each other's passions, dreams and values. But an emotionally abusive person often dismisses these aspects of your life. They may forget important details about your interests or goals, mock your hobbies or preferences, prioritize their own desires over yours. This lack of empathy creates a one-sided relationship where you feel undervalued and neglected. 7. You feel like you're walking on eggshells. Do you constantly second-guess your words or actions to avoid upsetting your partner? Walking on eggshells is a common experience in emotionally abusive relationships. 
You may avoid expressing your true feelings, change your behavior to meet their expectations, constantly worry about earning their approval. This hyper-awareness of their mood and reactions can leave you emotionally drained and perpetually anxious. 8. You often feel anxious around them. Being in the presence of an emotionally abusive partner can trigger feelings of anxiety and fear. You might worry about saying the wrong thing, feel tense or uneasy during conversations, anticipate negative reactions to your decisions or actions. This chronic anxiety can take a toll on your mental and physical health, manifesting as stress, fatigue, or even physical symptoms like headaches or digestive issues. 9. You feel isolated and alone. Emotional abuse often creates a sense of isolation. You may struggle to describe your experience to others because the abuse is subtle and often private. This isolation stems from a lack of mutual sharing in the relationship, feeling misunderstood or invalidated by your partner, difficulty explaining the emotional toll to friends or family. Even if you live with your partner, the emotional disconnect can leave you feeling profoundly lonely. 10. You experience chronic stress and fatigue. The constant tension of an emotionally abusive relationship can have long-term effects on your well-being. Many victims report symptoms such as insomnia or trouble sleeping, chronic fatigue and low energy, signs of post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, or complex PTSD. These symptoms are your body's way of signaling that something is wrong. Ignoring them can lead to serious health issues over time. Recognizing the patterns. Emotional abuse isn't about isolated incidents. It's a consistent pattern of behavior designed to control, demean, or silence you. If any of these signs resonate with you, it's crucial to acknowledge the abuse. Denial only prolongs the cycle. Seek support. Reach out to trusted friends, family, or professionals. Prioritize your well-being. You deserve a relationship built on mutual respect and love. Remember, emotional abuse can happen to anyone, regardless of gender, age, or background. The first step to healing is recognizing the problem and seeking help. If you're unsure how to proceed, consider reaching out to organizations specializing in emotional abuse. Support is available, and you don't have to face this alone. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below, and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end. Also make sure to check out our next highlighted video, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.